telling you now he's going to fucking do it within the next half hour. Even better, just so I can hear him, I'm going to change my fucking... Uh, just so I can see everything, I'm going to change my fucking camera and shit around. Motherfuckers crawling in my face and shit. spinner. Wait a minute. There we go. One sixth. Anything new happening on the crew now, Nick? No. no. I'm just what going through races and doing them all. Oh. Turns out there's like 18 new street races that weren't there when I first went through the campaign. So I'm going through and doing them all on normal difficulty. Since I can't do them anything harder until you finish them first, you have to finish it on the normal difficulty before you can do hard, and you have to finish it on hard before you can do it on ace. Fair enough. That's proving that you can actually fucking do the race. Boring. Tired is for tired people. Yeah, that's right, I said it. Oh, and it doesn't hurt. My car is so fast that before the first checkpoint, I can overtake all the other seven racers. Shit. Well, I got Need for Speed reinstalling, so if you and They're Shadow want to end up like, doing some races on that, we can. Like, like, they're all dumping an entire tank of NOS off the start line to get a speed up. I'm just holding... I haven't used any NOS yet, and I've easily outpaced them all. Shit. Good. What? 
I'm doing it, motherfucker. I'm yeah. gonna do it. Hey, look at that. Hey, Nick. Execute monkey. Order 66. Hey, Nick Monkey, guess what? I got a viewer. I wonder who it is. I don't know. Hey, Monkey, what was it you said that that guy that I don't like kept fucking saying for me to do? Unblock me. I don't know, man. See, I don't like traitors. See, he kind of insulted us behind our backs. Especially me, when I was the one that fucking stood up for him. Yeah, like... Like, there's not a damn thing he can ever do to fucking make up for that. Like, I do my best to try and stand up for the little tweeb. Make him seem like a nice person to the people he wants to be able to hear him talk. I convinced... I convinced them all to on multiple occasions to unmute him so that way he can be a part of the conversation and then he's just a fucking dumbass and an asshole to everyone rude then, then fails to listen to fails to listen, listen to and follow through on the rules he agreed to on games we play we set yeah. out honor rules that we're all going to follow and what's he do within 30 seconds of fucking starting the match oh so much for that those see, rules went out the window. No, you see, I'm What's a wrong? Fair I'm person. just saying the game the way it was made. But we you made see, extra, extra rules to change the game to make it more interesting. I see. See, I'm a fair person. Good. I really am a fair person. But when it comes to people saying they're going to go shoot up a school, that's just no bueno. Especially a school of kindergartners. That's pretty messed up. Then telling me that if I don't I add him, he'll he kill me. Or he'll kill himself or something like that. That's not okay. Well, I'm having a mental breakdown. No, you're not. If you were having a mental breakdown, I'd be hearing screaming. I'd be hearing you ripping your hair from your head. I'd hear your room falling apart as you have a fucking panic attack. Or, like, what he usually does is tell us that he's beating his mother with a 2x4 and stuff like that. Him to death with a 2x4. See, so I'm going to say this as clear as I can. Ninja knows about it. Oh. Ninja knows about it. She does. She does. I don't know, all I can remember hearing is him screaming at her, and I hear a big loud bang from a 2x4 hitting someone, and her saying, ow. But I'm going to tell say this once, and I'm going to say it clearly, because I know he watches the fucking live streams, I know he watches the videos. I am not unblocking him. It's never going to fucking happen, Ever. Especially after the shit that he's caused. My blood pressure is dropped. We all get along. And Shadow's even doing a lot fucking better. Instead of hearing, bitching and complaining every few seconds. So. And my heart rate's gone down to a steadier 60. Whereas my when Reno was around constantly, I'm pretty sure my heart rate was resting somewhere around 75 to 80. Because yeah. of anxiety. And bullshit. I mean, I refuse to forgive someone who says they're going to rape people's dead parents and stuff. It's not okay. Yeah, see, telling my, telling me that he hopes my grandmother dies with the shit that's going on in my family, yeah, no, that's that's never okay. No, it's But really especially not. not with the shit that was going on in my family at the time. God. Fucking damn it, I can feel my heart rate going up just talking about it. Can we talk, change the subject now? Yes, let's talk about other games we could possibly put on the channel. Okay. No, not anything. Fuck anything.
Yeah, fuck anything. We're not putting Super Meat Boy or speed runs on here. That I see insane. one fucking Super Meat Boy episode go up on this. I'm going to be very fucking disappointed in myself. I've already hit the low <laughs> point where I'm currently live streaming a fucking fishing game. <laughs> Let alone fucking my Super Meat Boy. My channel has live streams for Hunter Call of the Wild, Witcher 3, Crew 2... Battlefield, Rainbow, God only knows what else. Gross. Execute Order 65. Excellent. Let the hate flow through you. Do you know good, what it, Order good. 65 was? No. Pretty sure it had something to do with killing every single member of the Senate. Probably. I can't... That might have been an earlier order, or that might have been Order 65. I can't remember which one's which. Execute Order 66 is to kill all the Jedi. Yeah. Sadly, I they fucked that completely. I know... No, they didn't. Well, they didn't kill all the Jedi. Only, only like two of them, or no, like three of them got out. Yoda, because he killed all of the stormtroopers that were supposed to kill him, because he noticed and felt the disturbance in the Force as hundreds of Jedi around the galaxy were being shot to death or blown up. Mm -hmm. He could feel the anguish and the betrayal, and he realized that it was coming from the troopers betraying the Jedi. The ones that I know of that survived are Leia, Luke, Ben, Vader, and Yoda. Vader survived because he was leading them because he had just been indoctrinated to the Sith. Yoda survived because he had already started distrusting the stormtroopers, or the clone troopers a while ago, and he felt the disturbance in the Force from hundreds of Jedi dying. Uh, Leia and Luke were born after Order 66 was executed, and Ben only survived because he wasn't on a battlefield. He was going through the rubble of the Jedi Temple, figuring out what the fuck had just happened. But yeah, basically, still though, the fucking Order basically came back. Like, the Jedi Order has come back right now, like the new Star Wars movie that's coming out, uh, The Rise of the Skywalkers. I want to see that. I really want to see that. So do I. Because my question is, what Skywalkers? Luke didn't have kids. Good. Luke died Good in the point. last one. No, 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 no. Isn't one. He didn't die. He didn't die. He turned into a force ghost. Yeah. Um, it is actually stated in some books that are considered canon in the Disneyverse mm. that there is, in fact, a way to convert your soul from a force ghost to a physical body. Oh. It is entirely possible for anyone who has turned themselves into a force ghost without dying first thus omitting Qui-Gon unfortunately um, it, it basically allows them to come back from pseudo death it's pretty amazing hmm uh, I'm pretty sure it was a skill not presented in the sacred texts that Yoda burned to ash with a lightning bolt. Mm. I bored. I'm Helix. God damn it, it's begun. It's begun. Yeah, it is.
Oh no, he's not talking about me telling jokes. He's talking yeah. about the dad jokes. They've begun, and the child's not even past its first month of pregnancy. Oh, it's our, oh, It's probably did. is, honestly. We might actually be at, like, our fucking... Oh. Fifth month, or fifth week. You need to get to the baby doctor, whatever the fuck their name is. Fucking money grabbers is what they're called to me. What's... <laughs> what did you just call my child? What? I don't think anyone called your child anything. Okay. Continue. Mm -hmm. <laughs> of course you would think that the doctors whose job is to tell you A, what gender your baby is, B, how they're looking, or C, run a fucking ultrasound on your wife's or wife to be stomach would be a money grabber. When I hear a really fucked because up honestly, joke, because honestly, all the things they do is optional. Because you don't need to know the gender of your baby until they're born, unless of course you want to theme the room to a specific color. Mm -hmm. When I hear a really fucked up joke, just like keeping cum for a pet. God damn it, I've heard that one before. Uh -huh. You fucked. disappoint me. It's fucked. What happened? I wish. Felix, I don't Yo. know how, but I've made it so that way a 1970 Nissan Fair Lady is faster in raw acceleration and top speed mm. than a Lamborghini Gallardo LP570 that was dumping a tank of NOS. Fuck. Like, they were dumping a full tank of NOS to get as fast as possible. I overtook them just by putting my foot to the floor. No buttons, no giant fancy tank of magical gas that makes your exhaust burn blue. Just petrol in an engine. And I was going faster uphill than the Lamborghini. Shit. What song? Neither of us can hear it. Whose game is it on? It's not on my live stream, is it? Good. Oh, uh, you know what's funny? Hey, monkey, you want to know something funny? If you were to go into my live stream, she'd know exactly who, who who's doing the Stitch voice. I'm not the voice actor of Stitch, goddammit. You're going to make her... You're just, like, going <laughs> to crush her dreams. Like, she's going to see me. Ew, Stitch is ugly. I'm going to jail. I'm going to jail. <laughs> oh, shit. If you could see my face now. Oh, you see my fucking face. Uh. Jesus Christ. I'm gonna, you know what I'm gonna do one of these days? I'm gonna fucking go out into the middle of a fucking lake full of people, and I'm gonna throw a rubber duck in, like one of those inflatable ones, and I'm gonna blow it up as fast as I can. I'm just gonna scream at the top of my lungs. Release the quacken. <laughs> Now I'm going to climb release up its the, back and sit on its head. Quacking. 
And I'm going to sit on its head after it's fully blown up, and I'm going to scream hi-ho silver away. This is on your bucket list? This is my... This is my bucket list. Oh. Well, that, the list. only one that's actually reasonable. I'm pretty sure I can't put on a cowboy hat and ride a nuke into a, into a blast zone. Okay, no. I mean, technically you could... I don't think anybody if wants you, to see that. If you pull the right strings. And have a parachute before it explodes. You'll still die anyway. True. You seem to forget that anywhere that a parachute is effective is well within the blast radius of a nuke. Hmm. And there's not a damn thing you can do to save yourself after that point. I mean... The fuck is Treasure Island? Is it? Uh, fuck Disney. Probably something to do with the same horror ideas that goes to fucking It's a Small World. It's a small world after all. Yeah, pretty much that. Yeah. It was like the Shrek thing where they made that like creepy fucking side TV show for it. Where they go back to fucking Lord Farquaad's castle. The things come out all demonic and headless saying how you're going to die here and all that shit. The fuck? Yeah, no man, it's real. It's on Netflix. Look it up. Look up Shrek's scary stories. I'm going to tell you this much, okay? Two things that I hate in life. I hate the Germans, and I hate Disney, oh, because shit. they're the exact same. Nazis. Okay. Really? Please explain to me the skinheads. All the neo-Nazis and neo all that. With all the neo-Nazi propaganda plastered across their skin and permanent tattoos. You know what? I will give Monkey this. You're right. The Nazis are completely gone from Germany. And they're in the States. They're in Canada. They're all over the world now. The only difference is, is it's legal. they're legally allowed to be there now. And they're protected under the Bill of Rights in America to be able to say whatever the fuck they want. Yeah, as long as they don't go around killing people, they're fine. Yep. Although, if they decide to try and do that All Lives Matter bullshit where they started blocking roadways, I'm certain the, the uh, local ordinances that permitted drivers to run them over will easily be reinstated. Yeah. And people will get the big trucks. Mentally? I don't get it. Act! Monkey, what is it with you and balls? Are you sure? I don't know, he does have a boyfriend, right? Yeah, right. Me? I'm pissing you off? No, his sister. Oh. No, his sister. Okay. No, my name is Helix. No, your name is Michael Myers Bane. 
I am the man that gives fucking Freddy Krueger nightmares. Like if I if I was a killer, like if I was a made up killer, I would literally have Freddy Krueger's gauntlet. I'd have uh, Michael Myers' inhibition to just keep going, and I'd have uh, Leatherface's fucking uh, bloodthirst. And what's his name? And I'd have fucking uh, Deadpool's fucking uh, regeneration ability. What about Jason Voorhees? Jason Voorhees? Yeah, I have the face of Jason Voorhees. The one you hide behind a hockey mask? Yes. When you take it off, my my face looks like Sloth from the Goonies. You would be a Care Bear. Oh, uh, that makes me think back to the ultimate showdown of Ultimate Destiny. Bruh, listen, they made a a gay version of that song. It's called the, uh, what was it? The... Oh my god. Yeah. Creepy ass shit on YouTube, man. That is the epitome of YouTube poop. That and don't hug me, I'm scared, salad fingers, all that shit. Why, you don't like it? But I like rusty <laughs> spoons. I love the sound of the rust on my salad fingers. Ow, my foot. My entire my entire right foot just cramped up. I know more PlayStation stuff than you do. Yeah. Crabs don't hit. Stop letting her in your room. I agree. That was a mistake. One hour. Oh, hey, look, a uh, grass pickler. Yes, ma'am. Do not show her that fucking, uh, don't hug me, I'm scared. I swear to God, I will choke you to death. Okay. Is it a penis? Are you showing her a penis? That's creepy, man. You're a brother. The 
the animator 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 it's like tomator but without the tuh scary bendy animations bruh oh Colin must be making scary. animations of the bendy and the ink machine shit Ooh. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Those those three words do not go together in that order. Ever. Nah, you coming back now. You want to scare the shit out of someone? Type in rule 37 and then type in Tiny Tina. Uh, I'd rather not. I don't know what rule 37 is. Anything on the internet can be turned to porn. That's rule 34. Still, same shit. It's a rule. Rule, rule 34. If it exists, there is porn of it. Man, I knew there was a fucking porno out about me. I just fucking knew it. Typically, it takes less than 48 hours for a new Pokemon gym leader. But it happens to be a hot female for there to be porn of her. I have never watched porn in my life. I've also never Bullshit. inflicted physical or emotional harm on anybody. Bullshit on the porn. Thank you. At least at least someone called it. I don't think Monkey is present, but I know for a fact there can't be a single human male on this planet with access to the internet who hasn't at least searched porn once. No way in no way in hell can your imagine sate you enough. What static? Oh shit, I forgot Don't to know. say this. Um That's you, though. You're a pussy. <laughs> Peace.